Hi everyone, it's Alicia with the Docker Neat Dozen. And this is my weekly grocery haul where I shop for my family of 14. Um, it is Sunday evening. This is not my normal grocery shopping time, but this is where it fit into my schedule for the week. So I just dropped Zoe off at Odyssey of the Mind down the road, swinging over here to Wegmans to do the grocery shop. And uh, then I'll go back and pick Zoe up and head home for dinner. Let's go. I'm sneaking in the back door so I can start at the back of the store. This is technically an employee entrance, but nobody ever questions me. Here is my grocery list and is separated out by areas of the store. I'm going to start over by the dog food Whoops, section. We are out of Miracle's dog food, so I'm going to try this beef pound. She usually likes the chicken, but we'll see if she likes this one. I need more laundry detergent, and I know that the bigger one is more cost effective, but I make a giant mess of it at the laundromat. So I got to go with these little bottles. I honestly just switched to Gain when we started going to the laundromat. I feel like it helps my clothes smell better. Josh was organizing our closet today and we needed more hangers, so I'm gonna grab those. It is not on my grocery list, but I do need more dish soap. What scent do you usually get? Cups for our weekly float challenge. Also not on my grocery list, but I know we need more napkins. And paper towels. I love these select a size ones. Dixie has gotten so much better at house training, but we still have a few accidents. Now that she's nearly housebroken, I'm gonna get some carpet powder to do all of our carpets upstairs. My household goes through an insane amount of tape every day. <laughs> Bodie and Patrick and Jordan, they use it for every single thing. Speaking of Jordan, he loses one ice pack a day. <laughs> so I'm gonna get some more of my ice packs for their lunches. The kids like these paper bags to pack snacks in for school. Papa bought some garbage bags last week, so I don't need those this week, but I do need gallon bags and quart size bags because Zoe is flying to Iowa this week and you need quart size bags when you're traveling. I am definitely needing some white claw. Black cherry is in stock. It's gonna be a good day. We're having taco bowls on Tuesday. Um, sorry, tostada bowls. Uh, four come in a box, so I'm gonna get five boxes. I know that I have one box left over from last time. And we always need salsa in this house. We prefer mild salsa. I'm gonna grab some elbow pasta for macaroni and cheese. And before I left, I made the fettuccine Alfredo for dinner tonight and I used up the rest of the Parmesan. So I gotta get more of that. I'm out of a few of our spices, minced garlic, nutmeg, of course, my secret ingredient for everything, and pepper. I need white rice for grill night on Wednesday. I'm making salmon on a plank. Fun fact, we go through an entire package of Hershey's bar for one s'mores night. We made s'mores on Saturday and we're all out of Hershey bars. I need some baking ingredients. I'm really excited because Nana made her famous upside down apple crisp last week and everybody wants the recipe. So on Tuesday, she's going to make it for us again. And this time I'll get a video and tutorial from Nana. It 
And of course, I need chocolate chips and pumpkin for our weekly pumpkin chocolate chip bread. <laughs> Is it the healthiest thing ever? No. Do my kids love it? And will they remember it well into their adult years? Yes. The kids are really into Pringles right now. So I'm going to get a few now and I'll get more tomorrow when I go to Target. I am now making six boxes of Velveeta mac and cheese for one meal. Barbecue sauce for pulled pork on Thursday, as well as ribs on Sunday. Gotta get our weekly ration of ketchup. And applesauce. We are all out of Nana's annual homemade applesauce, but this is a close second. Olives, of course. Side note, look at this white claw display. I am using Spend Penny's Dr. Pepper pulled pork recipe on Thursday. So I'm going to get one thing of Dr. Pepper for that recipe. And then I'm gonna get another thing of Dr. Pepper to make floats for that night with it. I just thought that would be fun. I'm gonna get more 3D Doritos for James. Um, he said these ones were a little too spicy, so I'm gonna get this kind. And the purple bag Doritos for Alex. The kids are really into these puff Cheetos right now, so I'll get two bags of those. And I'm gonna get some Frito scoops to go with the pulled pork on Thursday. I don't know about you, but I like to scoop my pulled pork up with these. This is a full cart. I'm gonna go leave this up front. Cart two. These totally caught my eye. Red, white, and blue lollipops. My kids are going to love these. They will look perfect on my Memorial Day waffle bar Saturday. We are out of gummy worms. I'm gonna grab some of those. I like them on our charcuterie boards. They just look kind of cool. Nevaeh's birthday is next Sunday. I looked at the dollar store yesterday and I'm still not seeing what I want here. So I'm going to look at Party City tomorrow. We need more s'mores sticks. We use these all the time in the summer. They are the best. Josh requested more Fiji water. Last week, the kids took it all. So I'm going to get two boxes this week. And I need more sparkling water for me and Nana. And I noticed Nevaeh has been drinking it. And speaking of Nevea, I think that I will get some peach flavored ones for her. Maybe then she won't drink so much of the caffeine ones, the Celsius ones she's been drinking. Maybe I can convert her to these without caffeine. I totally just noticed big jars of queso. I don't always see these. I usually see the small jars. So I'm gonna get a few of these for the twins. Okay, I eat it too. <laughs> I'm going to grab some scones because Around the World Monday this week is back and we are visiting the country of Scotland through food and so we need scones. I'm doing a different route today. I'm going to go grab the produce next. Carrot. And celery. Let's see what's looking good with apples this week. Those are a little soft. These are good. What do we got? Gala. I'll get a bag of these gala and a bag of Granny Smith. Nope, not a good one. 
That one's good. If you listen closely, Josh and mine's wedding song is playing in the background. Give a little bit by Super Tramp. They are out of clementines, so I'm gonna grab some oranges. And I need some parsnips for leaves <laughs> on Monday, around the world Monday. I'm not really sure how many to get. I'm gonna get five. I don't know if my kids will like these. I'm gonna get some kiwi. I haven't gotten kiwi in a while. And yes, we already need more bananas. You know me, I'm going to inspect every single banana. I just hate getting home and then the bananas go bad in the next hour so I always look over the whole bushel and this should hopefully be enough bananas for two days I'm gonna make some coleslaw to go with the pulled pork. I am still creating my own recipe. If anyone has suggestions, let me know. Gotta get Josh his Brussels sprouts. I do not understand how he loves these. I don't get it. And green beans. We are super spoiled in New York. They pre-wash our vegetables for us. If you think I'm picky with bananas, I'm way worse with lettuce. It cannot have any brown on it or I will not buy it. This one is perfect. They are out of the grape tomatoes that I like, so I'm gonna get some of these tomatoes on a vine. I need some bell peppers. These are looking small, not very good. Um, these ones are pretty good. They are out of green grapes, so it's just red grapes today. These actually look really good. And time for some berries. I always check the bottom of the berry containers to make sure that they're not rotten first. raspberries for tomorrow's Scottish dessert. I do not know how to pronounce it. Cronachin? Am I saying that right? And the blueberries are pretty picked over, but these will have to do. I'm just now laughing to myself. <laughs> I put eggs under produce. Can you tell I wrote this list before I drank my coffee? <laughs> I'm gonna get some pomegranate seeds and head over to the toiletry section because of course we need allergy medicine. It is spring in New York. And Zoe needs some travel size toiletries to take on her trip to Iowa this week. Travel toothbrush, toothpaste, extra travel toothpaste. deodorant, shampoo and conditioner, and some hand wipes. We go through an insane amount of band-aids in this family. <laughs> so I like this family bag. Plus I get some extra big ones too. 
I'm going to head over to the bread section, which is pretty wiped out. I'll get our sandwich bread for the week. One loaf of bread makes 10 sandwiches, so I need over one loaf of bread for one day in our house. I need three packages of hamburger buns for pulled pork on Thursday. And they are out of hot dog buns, so I will get those at Target tomorrow. They are also out of bagels. They are also out of the big packs of Hawaiian rolls. I'm going to leave cart two up front with cart one and move on. Cart three, sour cream for Taco Tuesday. I just used the last of the cream cheese for the fettuccine Alfredo. And we're still eating more eggs than our nine chickens are laying every day. So I'm going to get three dozen eggs while we're here. They are out of my caramel macchiato creamer, but it's okay. Debbie Lige sent us some this week. We're all good. I gotta get Bodie his green cap milk. He prefers this 1% milk with a green cap. That is the nature of parenting children with autism. And chocolate almond milk for Alex, Bree, Dash, and Jason. Vanilla almond milk for Josh, Nevea, and Patrick. I feel like we always need more butter. Time to get this week's yogurt. Gotta get Patrick his SpongeBob Go-Gurts. Jordan and Harley have been eating these as well lately. Dash's Oreo Yo Crunch with Three's M&M Yo Crunch. And Bodhi likes these smaller vanilla Yo Crunch. He actually told Opa this week that they are his favorite food. Alex's Peach Yogurts for the week. And a few things of vanilla yogurt. I'm going to get some of these Chobani Flip Yogurts for some of the kids. And some more cinnamon rolls. Dash made five rolls of cinnamon rolls yesterday. And I thought for sure there's no way the kids will eat all of that. They did. In one breakfast, 12 kids ate five tubes of cinnamon rolls. Speaking of Dash, he's been asking for Lunchables this week, so I'm going to get a few of these. And in the deli section, I also need hot dogs for Saturday's lunch. our weekly ham and turkey for their sandwiches at lunchtime. We are out of whipped cream. The kids like these for their ice cream sundaes and their waffles. Um, this one looks super fun. It's like red, white, and blue. Perfect for Memorial Day. I'm gonna head over to the meat section. Tilapia for Wednesday. Our breakfast sausage that the kids love. I'm going to get some of the sausage meat. As well as the sausage patties.
let's go get some bacon. I love the center cut bacon, but not too marbly. I prefer more brown to white sections. I need pork shoulder for Thursday's pulled pork. One shoulder is a little over nine pounds. I'm thinking that I need two of those. I also need ribs for Nevaeh's birthday dinner next Sunday. I'm gonna get some regular ribs and some baby back ribs. On Wednesday grill night, we are having salmon on a plank. Um, this is the best seasoning mix ever. It's like a brown sugar rub for their salmon. I think I'm gonna get four of these salmon on a plank. And can I just say that I love that the seafood department knows I'm going to forget to buy lemons so they put them right here next to the fish. I'm gonna get some more of our Italian loaf that everybody loves. And some of my sandwiches that I like to keep in the fridge to grab and go. You know me, I'm always eating on the go. Veggie one looks good. I'll try that. I think I'll get some soup because, you know, it's dinner time-ish and I don't even know if I have lunch yet today. I really don't want to get a fourth cart, so I'm going to just put the frozen stuff down on the bottom there. We ended up having frozen pizzas for lunch today. I was trying to clean out the freezer a little bit after we lost power yesterday and um, some of the stuff thawed out in our one freezer. So I'm gonna restock the frozen pizzas. get our lactose free ice cream for the week and I am done for today the rest I can get at Target tomorrow time to check out my total always goes over their max amount allowed in one transaction so they have to call a manager over every time to approve it It is a beautiful spring evening here in New York. This is totally off topic, but check out my new keychain. It was sent to me by the Etsy shop Creative Triplet Mom. I am just slightly obsessed with it. Look at Duncan, White Claw. I love it. Does anyone else's dashboard have a pair of socks on it? No, just me. Okay. I'm going to drive over to load up the groceries. There are my four carts. Ended up being four once she bagged everything. And there's a helping hands to help load in the groceries. And that is another reason why I usually shop at Wegmans other than other places. Um, it just saves me time. It's so convenient. I mean, he helped me load those groceries in five minutes. 
and yeah i'm gonna head over and pick up zoe from odyssey of the mind i cannot believe she leaves for iowa this week kind of freaking out about it but it's gonna be okay this is gonna be the longest i've ever been away from her my mom is taking her um because otherwise i would have been going with 12 kids so it just seemed easiest for my mom to take her um but yeah I've never, the longest I've ever been away from her was two days when I had a baby, Dash, then Bodie, then Harley. Two days in the hospital. I got out of, every time I had a baby, I got out of that hospital as fast as I could. I just wanted to get home to my babies, other babies, even my C-sections. My one C-section, I was in the hospital for 47 hours total from when I got admitted till I left the hospital. I just, I'm a homebody. I like to be home with my babies. But I'm really proud of her. She's worked really hard, so it'll be good. It'll be good for her. Here's the receipt for people who like to look at the receipt. I still gotta do the rest of the shopping tomorrow. But I did a big dent today. So tomorrow, I don't know if I am gonna go to Walmart or Target yet, but I have to do Nevaeh's birthday shopping, everything for that. I'm actually, I'm gonna go to Party City, I forgot. Party City for the plates and stuff. And then I'll probably go to Target. I need to get her a TV and like a nice TV stand for the end of her bed. Um, she needs her own vanity and yeah. So that'll be another haul for tomorrow oh my gosh uh but yeah i'm gonna chill out for the rest of tonight wait for zoe to get out of her meeting and see you tomorrow you are strong you are beautiful you are loved you belong and i am so proud of you see you next time